What's the most conservative thing about you? Uh, I hate uh, <laughs> certain minorities. Whoa! <laughs> okay. What's your top three minorities that you hate? Starting with number three. Sri Lankans. <laughs> <laughs> we were really concerned you might just drop the N-word right from the top yeah. there. Right from the number three position. The number two least favorite group of immigrants to Hans Kemp. Native Americans. <laughs> Both. Why? They're poor and dirty. <laughs> wow. <laughs> oh, yes. There's one to go, everybody. The number one. Least favorite minority group, according to Hans Kim, is the blacks. <laughs> What's the most? Con <laughs> man, man, I was hoping he was going to say somebody else, man. I was hoping he was going to say somebody else, man. Why you had to choose us, man? That shit ain't right, man. The one time we first in the category, man, it gotta be for that, man. That shit ain't right, man. The one time we first, man. Of course, it's always the black women with weaves who want to hate on my beautiful, free-form, curly dreadlocks. It's like, no, no. Bye, Shaquandra. <laughs> of course, it's always the... <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. <laughs> Black women triggered, man. They didn't even hear what she said, man. It's hopeless, man. It's hopeless, glider woman. They didn't even hear what you said. They just mad about... They didn't even hear what she said. This woman hates black women with a passion. I can hear it in her tone. These black women? Like as if being black is a bad thing. The fact that none of them are responding to what she said is crazy. It's the black women with weaves who want to hate on my beautiful, free-form, curly dreadlocks. It's like, no, no. Bye, Shaquandra. Of course, it's always the black women with weaves. Stop it right there. It's always the black women with weaves. Let's see if we can find one woman who addressed that. Shout out to KFX, man. He said, commence with the fuckery, good sir. Happy Saturday, man. Yeah, man. It's up. Salute to you, man. KFX Op Nation Hall of Famer. Salute. Okay, here go one. Since it's the black girls with weaves, how about I, a black girl with beautiful natural 3D locks, say something. This ain't it, sis, and you're making your making a fool of yourself. I shouldn't just say this. Yeah, white people. Many cultures of white people have dreads. And if you go back to ancient if you go back to Africa when the when the um 
when the when the Portuguese and the fucking French and the British got there, them niggas wasn't wearing dreadlocks. Press one. Them niggas wasn't wearing dreadlocks. There may have been certain tribes in Africa that wore dreadlocks, but they make it seem like every tribe in Africa wore dreadlocks. Just as many tribes in Europe dreaded their hair. Now, if you see a fucking a fucking um, Asian with dreads, I don't even think Asians can dread their hair. Their hair's too straight. On Britos too, man. I don't think they can dread their hair. Their hair is too straight. White people can dread their hair because their hair is stringy and strandy. So it's not like white people... Def, would, would would need like some modern technique or modern invention to dread their hair. Their hair is naturally strandy and stringy. You said the Mongolians had dreads. I don't think I don't think tigers can dread their hair, man. It's too straight, man. Their hair is bone straight, man. You gotta have some. You gotta have something for the. It got to be able to, like, loop around. and You ever seen a, a, a Asian person use a comb or a brush? I've never seen that. I've never seen an Asian person brushing their fucking hair. Shout out to this white woman standing up for herself, man. Who want to hate on my beautiful, free-form, curly dreadlocks. It's like, no, no. Bye, Shaquandra. Of course, it's always the black women with weaves. Who want to hate on my beautiful, free-form, curly dreadlocks. It's like, no, no. Bye, Shaquandra. And why is it always black people taking ownership of something that's telling somebody else they can't do it? That's the only people I see doing that. I don't see any other race. I don't see fucking on Britos getting mad if a black person wears sombrero. <laughs> I don't see none of that shit, man. I don't see fucking Tigers getting mad if a black person start doing karate and shit. Larry, you be on TikTok. Listen, rate me on the scale from one to ten. Be honest, I don't care about ten. Uh, hold on, wait, let it go. So, uh, oh, I'm gonna give you a uh, a two because I only like black dudes. So, Larry, you be on TikTok. Listen, rate me on the scale from one to ten. Be honest, I don't care about ten. Uh, hold on, wait, let it go. So, uh, oh, I'm gonna give you a. Uh, a two because I only like black dudes, so I told y'all, man. The sun man, man. We might not be the most desired man, but hey man, listen, man. Sun man is listen, man. If you a sun man, man, and you like who like you, you'll never have a problem with women. Press one. If you a sun man and you like who likes you, you'll never have a problem with women. She may very well like thugs. A lot of black dudes are thugs. <laughs> Larry, you be on TikTok. Listen, rate me on the scale from one to ten. Be honest, I don't give a fuck. Ten. Uh, hold on, wait, let it go. So, uh, oh, I'm gonna give you a uh, a two because I only like black dudes. So, 
right, man. And if I see it all the time, man, it's true, man. I called you a, but that's about it. That's wrong. Doing yeah. your activities. My what activities? <laughs> your activities. Isn't yeah. your friend black? She's a. My favorite. Right? Yeah. I caught lack in saying people get pressed. Why do you say it? Out of curiosity. Yeah. Um you, you get you get joy in being racist. <laughs> I'm two percent black. Hi. Anyway. I'm the girl from the video. First and foremost, I just wanna say that I'm very sorry for everything I said. Those hateful and disgusting words that I used continuously was wrong and i'm not looking to be forgiven i'm just apologizing because what i said seriously embarrassed me as a person and those are hurtful words and i'm so so sorry just tell them your last name is hernandez and they and you get to say the n-word same person last name hernandez last name rodriguez whatever the fuck and none of them black folk would have said a word Hispanic people don't give niggas shit. Hispanic people don't give niggas shit. They had slavery in all them Spanish countries, Puerto Rico, Rich Coast, Dominican Republic, Mexico, Cuba. All them Hispanic countries had slavery. Niggas ain't got shit. They don't have no fucking wealth, nothing in none of them countries. No fucking Hispanic guilt. None of that shit. White people treat us better than everybody. I, I think white people should be able to use the N-word before um, Hispanics. Press one. Who think who think <laughs> If one group gonna use the word, if one group gonna use the um N word, man, it should be Hispanics, man. Yeah, white folks started, white folk invented the word too, man. It's cultural appropriation to use the N-word, man. It's cultural appropriation for us to use the N-word, man. We should be asking white people for permission to say that shit. That's their word. Let me do a poll, man. Pause, man. Cause I listen, man. I ain't gonna hold you, man. I've been around on burritos, man. I I did my time around on burritos, man. They were very nice to me. Don't get me wrong. But I got eyes. White people treat blacks way better than on burritos treat blacks, man. To me, I don't know. Why this white girl can't use the N-word if that Hispanic girl in the earlier video, she could say the N-word a thousand times in front of a crowd of black people and nobody going to say nothing. I'm about to put a poll up. Give me a second.
Yeah, man. I'm gonna put this poll up, man. Yeah, man. Give me, give me one second. Yeah, man. Shout out to Eric S. Op Nation Hall of Famer. Coming through from the thousandth night in a row. Salute, man. That's big time, man. Um, We're going to check on the poll, man. But uh, this is bullshit, man. If this fucking girl right here said the N-word, nobody would get married. What happened? If she would have been like, yeah, I like niggas, man. I like niggas, nigga, nigga, nigga. Nobody would have said nothing. And her people don't treat us nearly as good as white people. Watch. If you don't believe me, you see all these migrants coming in the country? Just watch black people. Since you want, because some black people, nah, you, 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 you know how much mouth black people be. They are just going to argue just for the fuck of it. If you don't believe me, watch. We got a perfect test case coming, you fucking moon crickets. You be on TikTok. Rate me on the scale from one to ten. Be honest, I don't give a fuck. Ten. Uh, hold on, wait, let it go. So, uh, oh, I'm gonna give you a uh, a two because I only like black dudes. So. And this girl right here, this white girl, I guarantee you, she love black dudes. I called you a. But that's about it. That's about it. Doing mm. your activities. My what activities? <laughs> your activities. Isn't yeah. your friend black? She's a my favorite. Right? Yeah. I caught lack and saying so we'll get pressed. Why do you say it? Out of curiosity. Yeah. You, um. You get you get joy in being racist. <laughs> I'm two percent black. Anyway, I'm the girl from the video. First and foremost, I just, just look at her. The lip fillers, the whole little dark around the eyes shit. She she attract she trying to attract black dudes. If she was trying to attract white dudes, she'd have her hair just down like behind her ears, just flowing regular. She wouldn't have no makeup on. She trying to attract black dudes, man. I just want to say that I'm very sorry for everything I said. Those hateful and disgusting words that I used continuously was wrong. And I'm not looking to be forgiven. I'm just apologizing because what I said seriously embarrassed me as a person. And those are hurtful words. And I'm so, so sorry. I called you a don't worry, man. Just give. Don't worry, baby. 
don't don't apologize to them some words man your people have been very nice to these people in flavor in flavor in flavor in flavor